Now, tonight, seven famous faces will take to this stage and perform numbers from our favourite musicals. Then you guys, the theatre audience, will get the chance to vote for the very first All-Star Musicals winner. And in case you're wondering what the hell I'm doing here, well, I recently made my debut in Fat Friends and Musical, and I was the toast of the West End. A Blackpool. All right. <laughs> I'm no musical expert, so we needed someone to guide our stars and give them advice on what it's like to perform numbers on this iconic stage. So my name is Michael Crawford, and I've been in this business since I was 12. In musical theatre, he's known for taking on some of the most demanding and legendary roles. I did my first musical, I think, when I was about 27. I got one of the leads in Hello, Dolly! with Barbara Streisand and Walter Matthau and directed by Gene Kelly, and that kind of changed my life. Michael's career continued to flourish as he earned his first Olivier Award for the musical Barnum. We had four and a half years where people filled the Palladium and, and the Victoria Palace and the Manchester Opera House. But it was his portrayal as the original Phantom of the Opera that secured him as one of the greatest and most loved musical actors of all time. To be able to play drama at that age, a discovery at about 40 years of age. I didn't have my first singing lesson until I was 30. So there's a chance for everyone. Uh, there's something inside us all that we may not know we have. Yes, I'm just slowing down now, but doing things I really like to do. And this has been one of them. <laughs> Please welcome the one and only Michael Crawford! <laughs> I'm crying already. <laughs> I think they were crying when I was singing as well. <laughs> Completely different reasons, mind. <laughs> now, let's clear this up straight away. You're not here to judge anyone, are you? No, 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 absolutely not. <laughs> well, what have you been doing to help our performers on stage tonight? Well, tonight is all about seven people from different walks of life, and they have never done anything like this before. They've spent three weeks putting in an awful lot of hard work to get where they are tonight, and so hopefully it's going to be a lot of fun. I'm sure it will be, but how does it feel performing in front of 2,000 people? Do the nerves ever go away? No, I think it should be the same if you, if you perform for 200 people at Lambeth Town Hall, which is where I started. <laughs> <laughs> it has to be exactly the same as when you perform on an iconic stage like this at the London Palladium for 2,000 people. Michael, we're going to be watching all the performers from the wings. So let's crack on and meet our first star performer. Good morning to you. It's one minute past nine. Let's speak to... My name's Nicky Campbell. I'm a radio TV presenter and journalist. I love... Musicals. I love the escapism. Sat in the audience so many times at the Palladium as well. What kind of experience have you got in musical theatre? None. <laughs> music has always been integral to my life. I've written music since I was about 14. But this is a different universe. When I was singing and then Michael Crawford came into the room. Hello. Hello. Lovely to meet you. You too, it really is. I struggle to remember a, a more extraordinary moment in my life. So what are you singing? Razzle Dazzle. Great. Yeah, in front of you. You've got to be good looking to sing that. <laughs> <laughs> what I love about Razzle Dazzle is the character Billy Flynn, who's got a lot of swagger, he knows where it's at and who he is. As to whether I'll be able to know where it's at and who I am is a different question. And am I going to hear you? Yeah. Oh, my goodness me. <laughs> G 
Give them the old razzle. Nicky Campbell, he's chosen Razzle Dazzle from Chicago. It has got great energy from beginning to end. The words are just so beautifully written, aren't yeah. they? Yeah. They ask for you to play with them and show off yeah. with them. That's a great tip. It's the one that has more, in a way, I think, sex appeal than any of the other numbers. And uh, I'm not sure how comfortable Nicky Nikki is with that. So. Those first tentative steps. Hi, everyone. How are you doing? This is Nicky. You don't know what you've let yourselves in for. I remember that first happening to me. And, oh, boy, you're so embarrassed. You've got a load of professional dancers around you, and you're trying to be jokey about yourself and <laughs> you're dead. how can they hear the truth okay above? okay come down a bit more oh. there yeah. yeah and you're an absolute you feel an absolute fool this is really nerve-wracking it's fine i haven't come down steps like this since the wheel of fortune in 1988. <laughs> when nicky walked into the rehearsal room and i started to choreograph the number he was quite overwhelmed there's a lot to think about when you're playing a character like Billy Flynn because it has to have a certain kind of arrogance to the performance. Give them the I love music, but I've never been a great dancer. I can't seem to translate it. Razzle, razzle. <laughs> I think his hardest job was to put the physicality to the musicality that he had. And that, that's where we've been working mainly with Nicky. Singing a great song at the London Palladium it really does take some getting used to. There's 2,000 people with that, is there? I'm still thinking in my mind it's going to be like three or 400. OK. <laughs> For the Five Live Breakfast programme, you can't see the list. You hope that they're there. This is just so different from everything else that I do, and I'm going to try and relish every millisecond. Ladies and gentlemen, playing the role of Billy Flynn from Chicago and singing Razzle Dazzle, it's Nicky Campbell! <laughs> Give them the old Razzle Dazzle, Razzle Dazzle em. Give them an act with lots of flash in it and the reaction will be passionate. Give them the old hocus pocus, beat and feather and How can they see with sequins in their eyes? What if your hinges are all rusting? What if, in fact, you're just disgusting? Razzle dazzle them, and they'll never catch why. Give them the old razzle dazzle, razzle dazzle them. Give them a shot away with murder. Razzle dazzle them, and you got a romance.
and Dexter and Nicky Campbell. Oh, oh. Oh. First thing is, Nicky, I've got to ask, why are you here? Well. You're, you're, a, you're a journalist. I thought I was out of my comfort zone. How did you find that? It's just the most amazing experience I'll never forget. I mean, my mum's 94. She's come down from Edinburgh to see it. <laughs> and if it's OK with you, she'd like to do a number later on as well. Yeah, feel free. <laughs> I've done one, I'm sure she can. <laughs> but you've obviously got the backing of the audience. Yeah, that's great. great. And you've got 25 members of your family and friends, as well as your mum. Yeah. But what did you find hard? I, how did you deal with them stairs? The stairs were an absolute nightmare. <laughs> because coming down, I had to have these special glasses done, which are period glasses. Uh, coming down, I was like that, and I was uh, arse over tit quite a few times. <laughs> but uh, eventually, I just sort of kind of mastered it. In fact, we caught each other practising the stairs just about We did, yeah. I, I found them tricky as well in that phantom mask. I don't know if Michael <laughs> did it. Well, finally, what have you learnt most from this experience? Because you look like you've loved it. Oh, it's been amazing. Uh, working with Michael, <clears> um, <throat> seeing your journey as well, which has been quite incredible, <laughs> ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> um, the dancers, uh, the singers, the directors, it's been... This is an experience I will never forget as long as I live. So thank you for... for being Ladies here. and gentlemen, let's hear one more time for Nicky Campbell! <laughs> right, we've got six more star performers to come, including Sally Phillips and Sir Tony Robinson, as you've never seen them before. So don't go anywhere. <laughs> Other star performers include Corrie's Lucy Fallon, Olympian Denise Lewis, and Emmerdale's Michael Parr.